is up guys it's so bad welcome back we are back with some more mobile legends and we have some uh some words from the developers um so in the last video i went over the patch and i kind of skipped a little bit of stuff because it was less important but these are direct words from the developers things that they've had to say about our feedback and the community's feedback that we have been giving them uh number one fair competition as first ever global cross server mobile mobile game we are constantly trying to create a fair competitive environment after adjusting the punishment rules afk incidents have seen an inconsiderate or considerate improvement but there are still some players who are in inconsiderate of others and just leave the game whenever they feel like uh so we we are implementing even harsher penalties on players who go afk Please view the announcement below for details, which they said. Meanwhile, you can also tap the red exclamation point button at the end of the results screen and report poor player behavior and help build a fair playing environment. Uh, so what this means is they're going to make the penalties on AFK people harsher. Uh, so if someone does go AFK or if they are flagged AFK by a set amount of people, the penalty is going to be a lot harsher now. Uh, there still have been a lot of problems where people just get mad just a couple minutes into the game because they die or something doesn't go in their favor and they just quit. And that's not fair to the people that are actually wanting to play the game. So I commend them for actually doing this and increasing the severity of the punishments for this. Now, number two, performance optimizations. To deliver a better gaming experience to players all around the world, our programmers have been toiling around the clock, particularly to implement major improvements for low and mid-level phones. And for the occurrence of lag and battles has cleared up markably. Okay, <clears throat> we've improved network traffic protocols so that players can enjoy happier, smoother battles in the land of Dawn. For players who don't have the best device specs, we recommend going to system settings and lowering the graphic settings to ensure smooth battle performance. Our coders will continue working hard to deal with various internet situations and the multitude of devices our players have around the world and give everyone a better gaming experience. Now, this is something huge. Basically, what they've done is they went back and re-optimized stuff to help with people that are actually playing on low to mid-grade devices. Uh, something that honestly could have been causing a lot of the lag if your device isn't up to par. Um, I've played on Note 3s, S6s, things like that, iPads. Uh, I've, I don't really have a lot of lag. Uh, I, most of the time, it's just high pings and then it just drops back down and it's fine. But this is pretty awesome for overall. Hopefully the lag will continue to decrease as they continue to address the issues in it. And I'm glad they are addressing these issues. Now, number three, the hero ability feedback. Uh, what they said was first, we'd like everyone rest assured that no matter if you send an issue to us via customer service or left a message on Facebook or in the forum, we have received it and are looking into it and we'll follow up on it. We'd also like to ask when players provide feedback on hero ability issues, please be as detailed as possible with your information and descriptions, including your ID, battle mode, and as detailed as possible how to duplicate it so that their team can locate the issue and resolve it a lot more efficiently. Thank you for your support. And what they're meaning is, you know, if something goes wrong, if something happens, screenshot it, note what you're doing, what happened, how it happened you know everything you possibly can get from what just happened that you're having trouble with and give that to them you know that's more viable to them instead of you just going to their facebook page or to the forums and saying oh my god your game sucks it's broke blah 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 that's not going to fix anything you have to give them feedback in order for them to fix this stuff and we've been doing that and you see that they are constantly updating this stuff. So please, if you do run across any problems like this, give as much information to them as you can because it's only going to help overall better the experience of the game in the long run. Uh, number four, old hero revisions. With your support, we've been constantly designing and releasing fun new heroes. Meanwhile, we've noticed that some of the older heroes looks have gone a little stale. Our revisions of Tigreal and Franco have received lots of good comments from players. This time, a longtime player companion and the superhuman figure, the malefic gunner Layla, is making a dazzling all-new appearance. 
and Layla's old original look will be given away as a skin to all players who already own Layla prior to the version 8.2. Thank you for all your support. Wow. Okay. So if, if, if uh, I think a lot of you were concerned, uh, a lot of you like the old Layla skins. So everyone that has the game before this patch will receive this skin for free. This is basically nostalgia for this game. You know, this character was the one you start with from the beginning. You will get to actually get that now. It's not going to actually go away, so you still will be able to use it, but there will also be the new skin for Layla as well. So that's gonna be pretty dope. Instead of getting rid of the old one, they're actually going to immortalize that skin because so many people actually do still like it. Um, if they would actually go back and just redesign and just make that in HD, that skin right there, that would be actually amazing. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to bring this information to you guys because I'm trying to keep these from being way too long. Um, uh, attention span, I'm not sure if you like watching 20 minute long videos of me just talking and reading text, but I try, I'm trying to break it down to make it a little bit more feasible for you guys. But thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like on it as it does help us out a lot. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.